Yo, 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 what is up, guys? Here to make a video about this blue face situation. I have been staying updated with it, and uh, the video has been posted of TMZ, of the incident itself that he's getting arrested for. So there, there's a video posted online of some undercover officers arresting Blueface at a waffle and chicken place. And they arrested him aggressively, as you can see in the video. It seems like they're arresting him for a violent crime and that they, uh, they assume that he's a dangerous individual in the way they apprehended him. Now, the incident stems that he's getting charged for. It stems from an incident where he was in the club with his guys in Las Vegas. His guys apparently get into a brawl with a certain guy. They beat him up. The guy leaves the club, goes to his truck, sits in his truck, waits until they leave the club, and pulls up on him. You can see it in the TMZ video. You can see a truck pulling up on him, and then one of his guys ducking down and walking past. One of Blueface's guys walking right by the driver's seat of the car. Now, you can kind of see, I think maybe Blueface pulls out a gun, the guy panics or whatnot, and he tries to hit the guy that's with Blueface. He drives right at an angle to the left, I think almost, if not scratching, the car that Blueface was, was trying to get in, that Blueface's guys were in. And he drives off. One thing you can tell in the video is that Blueface, who's wearing like a beige hoodie, he, he grabs his gun and he starts shooting. He f fires a couple shot shots at, at the car as the car is close by and as the car is fleeing. The truck with the guy who got beat up earlier in the night. Now, for that, he's being charged with attempted murder and shoot it firing at a at a home a house a business whatever a vehicle right so he's being charged with attempted murder and firing at the vehicle now these are some serious charges and generally attempted murder charges as a matter of fact are quite hard to prove there's no evidence that no one has said whether the guy he was shooting at got hit or not but generally, a lot of times, because of the difficulty of proving attempted murder, the, the prosecutors generally go for assault with a deadly weapon, which can also carry serious time. Okay, so it's not just that attempted murder can carry serious time, but assault with a deadly weapon can also carry some serious time if convicted. Now, in this incident... You can kind of think that perhaps Blueface is going, ha going to have some partial defenses, okay? He's going to be able to, to say that the guy approached him. Perhaps the guy had a firearm on himself. We don't know that. Perhaps the guy had a firearm as he was approaching Blueface, you know, and he was trying to use the vehicle in such a way to harm Blueface's friend. And Blueface had to use the firearm to defend himself and his friend, which he has a legal right to do. Now, when it gets to matters like this, it can be very complicated and is very much so on a state by state basis. And I think the indictment is stemming out of uh, Las Vegas. But that, that, that that's how things go. And sometimes if you're the initiator, say there was a certain incident that occurred in the club that night, but you didn't let it go and you came back later and initiated another altercation, sometimes in that case, you that, that other party, after you initiated the altercation again, can claim self-defense because you do not have a right to initiate an altercation again. Now, if in the instant moment they were attacking him and he tried to rush them with his car, that will be different from him waiting for them to get out the club and then initiating another altercation. And in the video, you can see that his his car is shifted, his steering wheel is shifted, and he's trying to hit the guy, ducking un under the, the passenger seat. So, And the way the guy was ducking, that could have very possibly been a firearm. Furthermore, besides that, um, an another thing about it is that well, well, that's it, really. 
you know, I, I can't think of any more details from the video or any more details from the information that's available currently that adds to the situation. So that's that's what Blueface is looking at, an attempted murder charge and another charge for sh shooting at a vehicle house or something like that, you know? So crazy charges. As you guys can tell, Blueface's career has been... I mean, you know, I don't think it's an exaggeration to say that Blueface's career has been going downhill. Um, he seems to be very seriously distracted by that uh, girl that he's messing with. I forget her name, but he seems to be very distracted by that girl, his girlfriend. Seems to be getting himself into a lot of things that are ruining his reputation as a rapper. And more so, you know... Um, turning his career into just a TMZ celebrity, a Shade Room celebrity, or a a uh, a reality star. Now, from a conversation that DJ Academics had with WAC 100 after uh, Takeoff got murdered, you can kind of hear from WAC 100 that this guy is seriously in love and that this isn't a game, this isn't fake. He is so in love with this girl that he's allowing it to affect his career and, and, and other things. So, real sad, you know, yeah, he, although I know a lot of people don't consider him the best rapper, I think he had a uniqueness about him and he had somewhat of a career. I know that if you guys do, are, are, are dialed into kind of like California, LA, street hip hop, I know that, you know, a lot of what he does does seem to be copying frosty the snowman i don't know if you guys know about frosty the snowman but it does sound like he's copying a lot of frosty the snowman and i think uh but frosty the snowman does it better you know but frosty the snowman himself doesn't really put out a lot of music anyway seems like a lot of these la guys you know but but either way whatever is going on in his career this would be if it goes to trial and if, if it re it's really looking bad, this would be the nail in the coffin for Blueface. Now remember, he wasn't involved in the altercation in the club, but he was involved in the confrontation outside of the club, and he shot his firearm. And as a matter of fact, even after shooting his firearm, he went back in the club and remained in the club. I mean, this is, you know, these rappers, man, they're taking crazy, crazy risks. Let me know what you guys think. I know I haven't made a video in a while, but I'm trying to get back into it. Peace out.